Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Unless you're new here, then hello, and thank you so much for stopping by. My name is Stephanie, and today I am very excited to be doing my very first Poshmark unboxing video. For those of you who don't know, Poshmark is basically an online platform that connects you to different people in your country and then you can buy and sell clothes on there. Not only is it clothing, but they also do things like shoes, makeup, purses and home items too, like pillows and blankets. This video is a little bit special because these six packages are specifically from the USA and I know what you're thinking. Um, Stephanie, don't you live in Canada? And yes, you are correct, I do live in Canada. As of right now, to my knowledge, the platforms are designed where sellers in the States can only sell to buyers that are in the States and the same goes for Canada. So you're probably wondering how this little old Canadian girl bought all of this American stuff. I'm not gonna really go into much detail, that's like something for a different video but basically I have a username for the states and a username for Canada both of them I will put in the description box below if you want to check that out and I also have referral codes if you ever want to use the platform but basically I use third-party websites and third-party companies to assign myself an American address and then I have everything shipped there and then there are ways to get them imported into Canada that's a pretty long process so I'm not gonna discuss it today of course there is the downside of having to deal with the conversion rates and then the import fees all the third-party fees. So depending on what you're ordering from the States, it may or may not be worth it for you. So you'd have to do a little bit of research first. But it is a nice option to have because I find that the Americans have a lot more options on sale and just nicer things, more things to pick from. And so that's why I decided to try some of the items from them. So without further ado, Let's get into it. So you are probably going to notice that a few of these items are very similar to each other and that they're just different colors, but that's basically the whole idea of why I was buying them from the States because I can't find them in Canada. So we're gonna get going with opening the packages that I'm so excited because I just absolutely love unboxing things and I've been waiting for a while to open these. I did put little sticky notes on the front of each package just for privacy reasons. And then I also did note the username of each person from which I bought the item, just in case you wanna check out their closet on Poshmark. So the first package that I have here today is from Tessa and her username is T Castillo 2112. I am so excited about this. This was actually the very first thing that I bought on Poshmark and I love the packaging of this. I love this poly mailer. Can you see it's just like palm tree leaves or some sort of leaves. Honestly, we don't have palm trees here so I'm not sure if that's what those are. But let's open it. Eh, I always feel bad wrecking nice packaging. Alright, so when I open it, everything is so nicely folded here and there's a little card. Oh, it's so cute. So obviously, based on the attire that I am wearing here today, I ordered more Buff Bunny and Tessa sent me this little Buff Bunny card with it. I'm gonna open it up. Oh, this is so cute. So she sent me this little Buff Bunny card that usually comes with all of Heidi's orders. I've never seen this one before though, so that's kind of cool. Oh my God, I'm actually so excited about this. Ah! So along with my order, Tessa sent me this Buff Bunny sticker and a Buff Bunny pop socket. I do not have these and I am really, really excited because I'm assuming that these might be from previous launches and I don't have these. So I'm actually so happy about this. Thank you so much, Tessa. And then she wrote me a little card as well. So let's open this. This is so cute. I love when people do stuff like this. And it's even handwritten. These are absolutely just so cute and such a nice touch. So she added in these little gifts because there was a little bit of a delay with the shipping, which honestly is not a big deal. It was still within time frames. It's totally all good, girl. But thank you so, so much for these. Honestly, this like made my day. So when it comes to little thank you cards and stuff like this, not everybody does these and by no means are they necessary. Poshmark doesn't say you have to send a thank you card with all of your items, but it is recommended. Obviously what matters the most is that you get your items in good condition, but all of these little goodies are definitely a nice touch. So I'm sure you wanna see what I ordered. I got this Buff Bunny Aurora crop top and a pair of the Luna leggings in the color Sage Green. These are in such good condition. Oh my goodness, I am so happy with this. And green is one of my favorite colors, pretty much all shades of green. This one is really pretty, I am so happy. This Aurora crop top is definitely from an older launch because it's different than this type of fabric, which is from the newer launch, but I don't care. I am so excited to try this on. As for the leggings, I actually don't own a pair of the Luna leggings, but when I saw this color, I was so happy. It has a seamless waistband and it has the pockets on the side, which is always nice. Thank you so much, Tessa. And next up on the list is a package from 
Gentry. I'm not sure if that's how to pronounce your name. Is it Gentry or Gentry? I'm really sorry, but her username is Gentry Kerr or Gentry Kerr. And it's so interesting to see where all of these people live because I'm actually going to be going on vacation to this place pretty soon. And it's kind of fun because I feel like I have a bunch of pen pals. So she used a priority mail USPS envelope thing. So she wrapped this one in kind of a tissue paper, which is really good because it keeps everything clean, keeps everything protected just in case. And what did I order from her? <laughs> you guys are gonna laugh at me, but I got more Aurora crop tops. Oh my God, I love this. So I got one in this violet purple color. This is so pretty and very good condition too. Thank you so much. This one I was actually a little bit worried about because in the picture that she had posted, it looked a little bit more of a coral color and I already have a coral colored one. But as you can see here, it's definitely more of like a light pink, which I am very happy with. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. Oh my gosh, I'm so happy. Oh my goodness, I'm actually just like so happy right now. These are literally like my most favorite shirt ever. I have like so many different colors from the more recent launches, but have none from the older launches because obviously they don't restock their stuff after they are out. So this is really one of the only ways for me to get my hands on older ones. I am so, so happy right now. <laughs> Moving on to my third package, meaning that we are almost halfway done. This package is from Melissa and her username is Mel underscore 102. I think y'all already know what's gonna be in here. Oh my goodness, this is so cute. Another reason I just love these Poshmark unboxings, obviously I haven't done one before, but I've seen others do it on YouTube, is because I just really like to see all of the different packaging that people come up with. So this is what Melissa has done. I have a little thank you card stickered onto the package on the front. This is a little bit of a different material than a typical tissue paper, but this is so pretty. So let's open the card first. So this is another handwritten card from her. Oh my goodness, you guys, it's another Buff Bunny sticker. <gasps> I don't think you understand how much I love these. Stephanie, thank you so much for buying. I hope you enjoy the Buff Bunny top. Smiley face from Melly C. Melly, that's an interesting way to say her name. At first I thought that said Mel C, like the Spice Girl, and I was like, what? Thank you, Melissa. Now let's open this. It's another Aurora crop top. Look at this one. This one I would say is kind of like a foresty green color. I think she listed it as like an emerald green, but it's definitely like a hunter green or like a dark teal. This one smells really good. <laughs> I'm not sure if she like sprayed something on it or maybe if it's just a perfume or something that she uses that happened to get on here, whatever. Another Aurora crop top to add to my collection. So next up, we have a package here from Lauren and her username is Lauren Mark. 13. I know exactly what is in here, obviously because I bought all of these. And this is honestly probably the one thing that I was the most excited for. So let's open it. First of all, this is really cute. I want to point out all of this cute little washi tape on here. Can you see it? It says here that it's going to be a very amazing year and you are very special. <laughs> I love puns and I love washi tape, so this is perfect. Oh my gosh, it also smells unless I'm totally tripping out. I probably shouldn't be smelling this because who knows where this box has been. This one looks like it had a little bit of trouble during transit, but that's okay because this isn't really something that's breakable, I hope. Let's open it. Oh my goodness, this is so cute. Oh my God, I love it. Okay, this is what it looks like when I open it. There's a little thank you card and then there's another little note here and it says, now this is gonna give it away and you're gonna figure out what it is just by me reading this. It says, may the force be with you. Tag me in your photos, smiley face, at Lee Industries underscore. So Lauren also has an Etsy shop and it's Lauren Lee Industries if you wanna check it out. And I think you're gonna wanna check it out after you see what I have in here. So the thank you card just says, thank you so much for your order, have a great day, XOXO, enjoy. I love this, this is super cute. More washi tape, and then when you open it up, oh my God, oh my God, I'm so excited. Are you ready for this? I don't think you're ready for this. Okay, I'm gonna show you, ready? One, two, three. <laughs> These are handmade Minnie Mouse ears that look like Chewbacca. Oh my goodness. These 
are so cute. <laughs> I'm so excited. Okay, the quality of this is actually really, really good. I love Disney in case you didn't know by now. So I am super, super excited about this. You know how you can buy the Minnie Mouse ears in the parks? They are super expensive. And I don't know if it's just me or like if I have a big head, but the bands on the ears that they sell in the parks are really tight on me. So I end up not being able to wear it for probably even like more than half an hour. It kind of gives me a headache. This one, it sits on my head so nice. You guys, I'm so excited about this. So not only am I a Disney fan, but obviously I am a Star Wars fan. So when the two of them kind of came together, it was like the most awesome thing ever. So I saw these on Lauren's Poshmark and I had to have them. These are so cute. The detailing on them is adorable. There's a little velvet bow. She has the little bandolier on here. Look at how cute that is. And yes, I know what a bandolier is. I'm kind of a nerd, okay? I am so excited to wear these whenever it is that I go to Disney next because I'm so excited to check out the whole new Star Wars land area. And these are gonna be the most perfect thing to wear when I'm there. Thank you so much, Lauren. On to my next box. This is another priority mailbox, which is really nice for the states because they actually get these boxes for free from their post office. And I'm sitting over here like, <laughs> Canada Post does not do that. All right, so this one is from Rebecca and her username is min underscore Rebecca. And y'all are probably just gonna laugh and roll your eyes a little bit some more because I got some more Aurora crop tops. Now these ones I've actually never really seen before, which is why I'm so excited. They have a completely different Buff Bunny collection logo on here. So I got one in white and I got one in black. Obviously I already have a black Aurora crop top, but no, I don't have this one, okay? This one has the logo on the front. These ones must be from a very old collection. So I am very happy to add them to my collection. Thank you so much, Rebecca. Guys. We only have one more box left and I'm actually really sad about it. This one is from Lydia and her username is lkriniki1. Okay, so let's open this. I will have you know, just in case y'all are judging me right now, this is not going to be another Buff Bunny Aurora crop top, okay? Oh my God. We have here guys, a pair of the Buff Bunny Jasmine joggers. Wow, these are in really good condition. Did she even wear these at all? So this is a pair of the Buff Bunny Jasmine joggers, which I am also wearing right now in a different color. And this, I believe, was in the color basil, but it kind of looks more of like an olive green to me, which is totally fine. But I was kind of expecting them to be a little bit darker. But like I said earlier, I like green, so I'm totally okay with this. So other than the Aurora crop top, my next favorite item from Buff Bunny is the Jasmine Jogger. So naturally, I was super excited to get these, and I'm now just realizing that the Aurora crop top and the Jasmine Jogger are both named after Disney princesses. Coincidence? I think not. It's like having three of my favorite things all in one. Jasmine Joggers, Aurora Crop Tops, and Disney. Ha! Ah, I'm so funny. Thank you so much, Lydia. I'm very happy with these. Well, that's all I have for you guys today. So I hope you enjoyed my Poshmark USA unboxing video and make sure you stay tuned because I'm actually gonna be doing one for Poshmark Canada as well. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in my next video.